Okay, good morning guys. Welcome to today's vlog. Today, we're gonna start off the day at Gouda. You might know the famous cheese called Gouda. This is the place called Gouda, where the cheese comes from. And it's famous for, well, cheese. So, we're gonna go ahead and look at cheese now, I guess. Baby small and medium goudas. They're like in different sizes as well. And here are the big ones, the proper ones. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. It's really good. It's really good. It's really good. Mm -hmm. It's super. Wow, it's really good. It's really good. Mmm. It's always good to know where to go and not to make the signs confusing or anything like that. No. This is how fast we are. We're literally faster than a plane taking off. Go, 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 go. As of this point in the vlog, the audio quality isn't the best because it was super windy. I tried my best in post production to fix it. I hope you guys enjoy it anyway. Okay, so we are currently on the Abschlussdijk, which is the Eisenmeer Dam. And this is either the longest dam in the world or for sure Europe's. It's extremely long. And I'm eating a yummy cookie I got in Gouda. Mm, so okay, so this is the Nordsee, and this is the Eisenmeer. And you can see that this water level is higher than the one over here. That's why this dam is so important, because otherwise the Netherlands would be underwater and flooded. So right here you can see the builder of this dam. Here's some pictures of how they're building it. It used to be all flooded stuff. I mean, it's hard labor work. And if you look over here, you can see how much manpower and also how much and how many resources they've used to build this entire thing. Each single one of these boats equals to two boats, and each single one of those bricks equals to one million cubic meters of brick. That's the old city we're going to. There's the beach, and this is the North Sea. This looks. Really cool. So we are currently in Friesland, in the city called Harlingen. We are currently at the docks, as you might see in the background, and we're on our way to take a little drive through the city to look at it. As you can see, the architecture is very cute. It's very nice. It's like a cozy situation over here, um, but it looks very British, at least in my opinion. Um, but it's nice. I'm not saying that British is bad, don't get me wrong. I have many British friends. I'm not British, racist, or whatever you call that. So, we're driving through the city just to get a little feel for this town. It's, it's really not Deutschland. General steam hauling. Guys, I told you we are in Great Britain. I knew it. We just drove too far. This is kind of a nice little area right here with lots of little stores and like restaurants. And they have all nice decoration, like, give me two seconds, up above, they have these nice little colorful ribbons, I guess you call them. How do you call this though, up there? It looks really nice. Lots of stores. This looks cool, look at this. Okay, so if you guys ever should be in Harden in the Netherlands, go to Oase on Grote Bredeplatz, right back there. It was delicious, the food. I only can recommend it to all of you guys. I'm kind of getting sick, as long as you can tell. My nose is stuffed, my voice sounds different. Okay, so we were at the pharmacy and they said we should go to a candy store and buy these little candy bars because they apparently help better than the medicine in the pharmacy, which sounds weird. Let me try it. Whoa. It's salty candy. It tastes horrible. So schlecht kann es mir gar nicht gehen, dass ich das. 
Äh. Damit hat sich auch. Du auch keins mehr, oder? Boah. 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 Okay, so we just tried this horrible, disgusting candy. It was salty candy. Which apparently helps. Uh, we went to a different pharmacy, bought proper medicine. I just took that and I already feel a bit better. Um, my tongue feels a little bit numb. But besides that, it's fine. This place where we are, it's very small. There's some wedding dresses in the background. There's a church right up there. Let me show you guys. The church is right here. A little Italian restaurant. And it all looks quite nice and stuff, but it's extremely boring here. Like, I would not want to live here, trust me, like, nothing happens. Like, the population, the average age here probably is, like, around 60, and there's not a lot to do. So, I'm going to end off today's vlog here. I hope today's vlog still was interesting. Uh, the cheese was great in the morning, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Goodbye, guys. Yeah. Und ich will es jetzt nicht verschwenden. Hat keiner gesehen? Ich höre nicht. Nö, du stehst nur blöd daneben und schaust zu, was für ein Vollidiot da was macht. Ja, der hat nicht gut gearbeitet. Ja, gar nicht.